Hi everyone and welcome to my quick tutorial on how to use Warbler. I'll also be giving you a few tips and tricks later. First of all, Warbler is a thermoplastic material. A fancy word, but the meaning is quite simple. It just means that you can form it as soon as it gets hot enough. So we'll start with just that. Prepare your table with a silicon plate, a heat gun and of course Warbler. We'll take the heat gun, it sounds a lot more violent than it is, and put it on the first stage. Many will put it on max to be faster, but trust me and be patient. Next thing you want to do is warm the warbler. As soon as it gets shiny, you can carefully lift it and flip it. You must be careful not to burn yourself. Now we heat here as well. Repeat this pancake flip a couple of times and then you can form the warbler. You can shape and form it however you want to. Now if it's the first time you use warbler, you should make something easy, like a little ball. Now to the tricks I mentioned earlier. If your fingers aren't quite as heat resistant as mine, keep a bowl of water close. The water won't bother the warbler. If you got a lot of small pieces, you can use a toilet paper roll and put them inside of it. Then heat it until it sticks together. And now you can flip it like always. If you got one at home, you can also use a silicon mold, but then you need to be extra careful. The inside heats up really fast. The last thing you want to know on how to make the best use of your warbler sheet is how it's reusable. If the thing you craft doesn't look good by the time it's cooled down, simply reheat it and reform it. The last step is to take all the leftovers and put them on the silicon plate. And then you put the silicon plate into the oven. You should now make sure the oven is in a cozy 120 degrees Celsius. Be patient and it should melt together after a few minutes. As you can see, it's now one again. Thank you guys so much for listening and I hope I'll be able to teach you another thing another time. Everything changes.